Tuesday morning, this morning I woke up at four with Dwayne and then um, I went back to sleep and woke up after eight. Now it's 9.20. I'm gonna make some breakfast. I don't feel too good and I can't really explain how I feel. It's just one of those moments. Anyways, I'm really trying to see if today I can make this. This is a cornbread and um, get some meal prepping done. I had it planned out that today I was going to go to um, Marshall's and buy something. But let me just tell y'all how I am. You know how some females are true shopaholics? I feel like I do. Do you shop if you don't actually buy it? Or do you use a window shop? So I'm a true window shopaholic. Most of the apps on my phone, like Forever 21, um, H&M, stuff like that, my carts always have stuff in them. But I will not buy something if I feel like I don't need it. And most of these things you don't need. Right now, I need some tops because truth is, the tops that I've had are falling apart. The most <clears throat> um, thing I've bought is... I buy jeans the most because I wear jeans to work and most time I wear jeans when I'm going out and I've always had like a lot of tops so I always had more tops so I just kept buying jeans now I have more bottoms than I do have tops and most of my tops are old and worn out and stuff like that like I said I just wake up woke up don't just oh, I woke up and showered I washed my face with the black soap and that black soap gets you you have to moisturize afterwards so um I, and I love, I love getting, getting cash back. I love maximizing my money, right? So, I use Ebates and so it's just like I do have stuff in my carts but I'm not going to buy it. I prefer to see my money in my account and know that I have it than to buy something that I'm not going to wear at least not anytime soon and not have the money. And it probably sounds a little bit crazy now and that's how I managed to save because a lot of times I wonder and I want to, um, check out and stuff and it's just not happening and it's the same thing with air pastel too i had a few tops that were for a hundred and something dollars it was a lot of tops because they're having a sale and every time i go on the website i wasn't able to check out so i'm just like you know whatever let me just go on old navy and i spent 60 something dollars on old navy and i got a dollar back it doesn't sound like a lot but when you get a dollar back, that's amazing. Oh, I needed to go on Kohl's. It's 3% cash back. So this is how it works. It tells you all the stores and how much cash back you'd be getting from each store. So it's for you to decide which store you want to shop from or to see the ones with the most cash back. Right now, NYX is having 10% cash back. But I don't want that. I'm from NYX. So I don't force myself to buy something just to get the cash back. I buy from places that I actually want something from just so I can get the cash back. And I actually buy stuff that I need. I don't buy anything that I don't need. So right now I have a dollar and 34 cents cash back. The last time I got cash back, I got $14. It was in Christmas though where, you know, everybody was having sales and stuff like that. Anyways... I bought some paper towel and like some Ziploc bag last night when I was coming home from the Dollar Tree and they're literally still in the bag over there. Also last night when I came home doing cooked and the food tasted really good, I'm not gonna lie. I was actually surprised because I left shrimp out for him to cook and he cooked chicken. When I seen it on the plate, I was like, oh my gosh, what did this man do? But it tasted really good. Um... Yeah, I'm trying to feel like I'm in a better mood and I want to get stuff done today because now I just have two day offs. So I have to go back to maximizing the two day offs. So I feel so tired. I just took some mutton out. I'm going to make some curry oat. And I'm going to have some cereal for breakfast and like catch up on some YouTube videos and upload a few throughout the process of today. But um, I just wanted to pop in and start the vlog from early just in case i don't vlog for the rest of the day honestly so um yeah so guys it is 10 38 i can't the last time was 
I think after eight or after nine, I have successfully edited one video and uploaded three videos to YouTube. My videos are scheduled way ahead of time and stuff. So I've been doing good all morning. So now I'm going to, I need to wash my hair either today or tomorrow because today and tomorrow my two days off. But um, I don't know. So I think I'm gonna unpack the bags and make this thing because the meat hasn't like fully defrosted it. I'm wondering if I should make, maybe I should make some stewed chicken because last night Dwayne cooked curry chicken, so. What? They keep telling me that the video is a duplicate because it's been uploaded before. Where? with the mixture and now I'm waiting for the oven to preheat and then I'm gonna pour the mixture into the pot into the pan that I sprayed some cooking spray into so um yeah but the battery is blinking so about to go it says to put it in for 16 to 18 minutes so I did 17 minutes and I'm gonna check on it 16 minutes has it really been in there put it back to 17 but um yeah so now I'm gonna clean up when I'm in the kitchen I really like to clean up as I go along so while I'm making something I like to clean up at that same time too so by the time I'm done I don't have like a whole sink of dirty dishes because that kind of drives me crazy so um I'm gonna just wash these dishes real quick and then I'm going to start editing the clips that are on me the so it's finally done. I decided to take some chicken out instead of the mutton because, um, why? There's curry chicken on the stove, so I don't want to make curry mutton when we had curry yesterday, even though we don't mind. But I'm trying to just switch it up a little bit. So now, while this is happening, I'm going to go clean up my bedroom. I think I'm going to change my... The under sheet. I need to text the winter to remind him to come early so he can go drop the clothes off. But let's go do that now. <laughs> The sheets are clean and they smell so good just because of the thing that I sprayed on there. Oh, I'm so excited to go to sleep. I'll see my hair. So, when I'm done making the thing, I just checked on it in the oven. I'm going to shower, wash my hair, and go to sleep. Because I'm a little bit tired. Oh, shit, I didn't even make the dinner yet. Guys, the cornbread is done and obviously I tasted it. So, here's my consensus it does taste like cornbread i'll give you that but the only thing is it does not you can taste the 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 cornmeal and stuff so it tastes like a cornbread it just doesn't have any that cakey baked taste so i feel like the next time i'm doing the next one i should add 
some of my vanilla extract to give it a little bit of flavor and I still think I'm gonna add some raisins to it because I love raisins but now that I made it and it came out like that I think I'll just add some raisins add um, a little vanilla extract and stuff like that anyways I think I'm gonna end the vlog right here because it's super long already like I've already started editing it and it's mad long that's already 10 minutes you guys probably can't even see because shit don't be wanting to focus Anyways, it's already 10 minutes. See what I mean? I'm always just talking. So I'm going to end the vlog here and start a new one. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you guys in the next vlog.